can go inside. You can take pictures now. And welcome to Jurassic World. <laughs> <laughs> Ayan. All right, so everyone here the viewing area. So this is the longest and uh -oh. the oldest crocodile here Ayan. in Rockland Park. Bebe, laki. Imperial Pigeon Wild to. Ganda pala. Oh? You know? Ayan, isang magandang buhay mga ka-farmer Kahit pagod Laban lang Ayan, ah City tour naman tayo Para naman masulit natin ang Puerto Princesa ah, Pero ang sarap bumalik dito, grabe Kumain kami sa Karinderia Ang sarap ng mga isda nila mga ka-farmer Murang-mura Ayan 160 kami dalawa lang <laughs> Ayan, may itlog pa on the side May kape pa So ayan, ah City tour tayo. Ayan, si Kuya Lloyd and Nick. <laughs> Anak niya yan. <laughs> ah, ngayon ba? Hindi <laughs> ko Ayan, una ka na. Sana ang unang destinasyon? Malayang sa runaya dito, sir. Kukodail, ah? sir. Para palapit tayo, sir. Kukodail. Hindi, magpalaba muna tayo. Opo, eh. Daan natin muna niya, sir. Daan natin na. Opo. Ah, kukodail tayo? Opo, kukodail. Gusto ko magpakagat, eh. Kunti lang. <laughs> Pero may brands? Ah, konti yung ano, urot lang ba? Pwede ba yun? Hindi mo rin hawakan yun sir, patiksyo ka, may mga anak yun sir. Ah, parang sa Davao din yan, ano? Ano yung kinamitra ba yun? Iba, iba. Alam ko kasi maraming crocodile dito sa Palawan talaga, ano? Opo, opo. Ayan. Ito talaga yan. Ito yung alamitra, baka sila na doon magayan. Ayun. May mitra naman sir, ano yung mga manukan eh. Ah, puro man, oo. Nariligay sila sa manok, diba? Oo nga, sabong hero talaga sila, na. Naalala ko manok ni San Pedro, eh. Esteban. Nanunod ako nun dati. Barangay? Dinigiban. Dinigiban? Opo, dinigiban. Mahirap pa nga, ano, ha? Barangay, dinigiban. Tapos yung crocodile ang una natin pupuntahan. Opo, barangay. Yan ang pinakamalayo, tapos pabalik na tayo. Tapos pabalik na tayo, sir. Okay. Yeah, nak merong tipe langan tu di sini, no? Multika, multika. Arang sibu, sa sibu, marami nyan. Krokodil. Ay, bapa tingin pada tayi mama ya, pak bapa birthdaynya yo, nasa bijan nanti na, pagendang, pak bati nanti kai bijan. Ayah. Krokodil eh Ayun Bigyan natin ang malupit na shout out Ang ating kaibigan Ciao Amici Bon Compliano Maki Lagrimas Ayan Bon Compliano Amici Happy birthday sa'yo So ayan Tandaan mong meron ka farmer Na naghihintay at nagmamahal sa'yo Ha 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 mala Cesar Montano hindi joke lang yan so ayan ah, dito po tayo sa crocodile farm natin kung anong meron dito napunta na rin po kami sa Davao ang dami ding buhaya doon mga farm 
apa tempat ah? <laughs> buaya nah anak pun dalam wampak ah meron ba <laughs> ayun pala oh si ano to artista ito ah bebe sini yan malimut asunta ba hindi ba Oh, ayan, hindi ko alam hindi yan wow, abot pa tayo oh, ah, oh, 5 minutes punta na kami doon ay, si. Picture na Ah, close na po yung kubo? Ayun doon pala, bebe. Ayun, oh. Thank you. Dito pala ang kubo, may sangkala ng lechon. Ayun, ang laki. Ayun talaga. Oh. Oh, picture picture daw muna. Ang laki ng buhaya, oh. Wow. Wow. Ayun, may copyright na content lock din naman. Dito meron ba? Wala, ayan. Nakakalabas. Laki. Shoutout pala kay Nanay Christopher Min. Sabi niya, anak, uh, maganda dyan. Pumunta kayo sa ano. Uh, sinabi niya to eh. Crocodile, uh, crocodile uh, farm nga daw. Ayan, papasok na tayo. Are you going to here inside? Mr. just one need for double the You two will you two will start in one minute. Ba, no? Yan yan, ito no hmm. Ano kaya ang ano, hindi pa si Lolong yan Namatay na si Lolong, di ba? Oo Palawan Ito ang tunay na baboy ramo Pagongski Ayan Porcupine Briefing na, briefing Rio is a male salt water crocodile 
which was called El Rio de Baribur Batarasa, and that is in the southern part of Palawan. He was purposely captured because he attacked and killed a native fisherman from the area. And it was confirmed that he swallowed only the right leg of the victim. Mm -hmm. Another one who was captured in August 4, 1990, but after five months in captivity, Rio died because of internal bleeding and too much stress. Mm -hmm. He is about 60 years old when he died, 60 year old, so for this kid, there's no commercial value anymore. Wala na po itong halaga. Because the nearly the one being used for making leather bags, shoes, wallets, and other products are the skin of the young saltwater crocodile, which is about three to five years old only. Oh, because okay. everyone, if you can see, or if you can notice the skin of Rio, it is too hard and very dry for the machine to be processed. So for the skin of Rio, for display, use only. And everyone before Rio has a record of being the largest crocodile captured from the wild. Nowadays, Lolo holds the record. If you remember Lolo, po, or Lolo, Lolo, Lolo had been recognized by the Guinness Book of World Record as a largest crocodile in captivity with 20.3 feet long, around 6 meters. Okay. Rio, 17.6 feet around. 5 meters. Lolo is almost 1 meter longer than Rio. But he's not from Palawan. Lolo is from Agusan Marsh in Mindanao. Oh, he was captured in September 3, 2011, but last in 2013, he also died because of stress. And stress well, related okay. to his environment. If you want to see him, if you want to see Lolo, he was this big now in National Museum in Manila. Mm -hmm. But actually everyone, the name Lolo, in honor to his lead captain, Mr. Ernesto Lolo Cunyate, the one who came from Palawan and the former employee of this project. Suddenly, Mr. Ernesto died before Lolo the crocodile was captured, but that because of crocodile attack. He died because of heart attack. Alright, so everyone's our next station will be the Hashley House, but before we go there, I just want to remind you for your safety. Inside the Hashley House, please hands off. Do not put your hands and things inside the trunks of the baby crocodiles. Even though they're still young, but they can jump right and cut off your fingers. So please hands off. You have covered cell phones, you can take pictures, but please, no flash. Right? So to minimize the stress of the young crocodiles. And lastly, as we go to the fence of the big crocodiles, we will see the almost same size of Rio. Kasi kilami po niya at buhay na buhay pa. Please take out the things that are falling inside the fence because they are not so sure how to get it back for you. Okay? Especially your phone. So you can take pictures, you can take pictures, videos, but please turn off. So everyone, the guy leader is only time for 15 minutes, but if you have questions about crocodiles, you can ask me along the way. So for now, let's go to the next crocodiles. This way. As a leader here in the Philippines, because they cannot survive in the tropical countries, ayaw po nila sa may init po na bansa. Mm -hmm. So alligator can only be found in the temperate countries like the United States, China, and also in a subtropical country like in Florida. But one of the difference between the crocodile and alligator are the snout. Yung uso po nila. Because the snout of alligator is like a U-shape, while the crocodile is like a V-shape. Saltwater crocodile is bigger than alligator because the maximum size of alligator, 4 to 5 meters. Saltwater crocodile, 6 to 7 meters. Saltwater crocodile is the biggest reptile and also crocodilian in the whole world. But everyone here in the Philippines, we have two kinds or two species of crocodile. So we have saltwater crocodile or Indo-Pacific crocodile and freshwater crocodile or Philippine crocodile. Philippine crocodile was first discovered in Mindoro and that's why the scientific name Crocodilos mindorensis. And Philippine crocodile is one of the smaller crocodile in the whole world. Isa po sila sa pinakamaliit na buhaya sa ating mundo because their maximum size is only 2 to 3 
meters. But sabi ni everyone, Philippine crocodiles are now critically endangered and that's why we are here. We conserve them, breed them, and then after five years, if they have chance, they can release back into the wild. So that is the main uh, other purpose of this project. Conserve, breed, and release. So we're not allowed, we're not licensed to kill any kinds of crocodiles to make them products, only for conservation. But everyone, all crocodile products, like for example, crocodile meat, crocodile sisig, tapa, barbecue, burger, lechon, and also crocodile <laughs> ice cream. Those products are from Teresa Rizal, or Tanay Rizal, and Crocodile Park in Davao City. So they have license from DNR to commercialize the crocodile, but only saltwater crocodile are permitted to commercial. Because again, Philippine crocodile critically endangered. Everyone, if you want to try crocodile ice cream, you can go to Davao City, and, <laughs> and that is made from crocodile eggs. And actually everyone, crocodile meat have a lot of good benefits for the human body like good for the heart and also in asthma. So uh, actually, sabi po nila, crocodiles is good taste though po. Sabi lang yan. Alright, so everyone said we have freshwater crocodile. And also, you will see the difference between the two species of crocodiles. So everyone, um, if you can see saltwater crocodile, actually this is the picture of the saltwater crocodile. If you can see their black spots are scattered all over the body. While Philippine crocodiles, their, uh, their black spots are aligned. They start from the tail, then up to the body. So mm -hmm. that is one of the difference between the saltwater and the freshwater crocodile. Again, crocodile, their spots are scattered. Freshwater crocodile, their spots are aligned. Okay? Mm -hmm. So again, everyone, for your safety, inside of this area, please hands off because crocodiles, they have 66 sharp teeth. Mm -hmm. And for the safety wow. of the young the crocodiles, right, so please kindly turn off your flesh. Okay, to minimize the stress of the young crocodiles. So if you have questions about crocodiles, you can ask me inside. Okay? okay. So you can go inside, you can take pictures now, and welcome to Jurassic World. <laughs> <laughs> Talagang mabagal sila lumaki, ano? Ayun o, batik-batik nga. Ito yung fresh water Ayun Ano nga yung Ano nya, iba ang kulay Ayan, salt water Salt water Ito fresh water Ayan Fresh water, oh. Tapos. Salt water. Batik-batik. Hindi lumili niya. Oo nga, ano. Sige lang. Sosyal. Hindi po, ma'am. Crocodiles po is kanilang Only meat lang po Yes, sir. Actually po, mga nasa 5 to 10 inches yung dinadagdag po nila per year. Konti lang. Pero kung gagamit po ng warm water, Ah, katulong po 'yun sa pagtul uh, paglaki kaagad ni crocodile. Ah, uh, mas gusto nila yung warm. Yes, warm sir. Warm. Yun din po yung ginagawang technique ng mga farmers para po mapalaki ang habit ng crocodile. Ah, uh, para po para may rin po sila kapuwang um, skin or mas malaki po makukuha ng skin and also meat. Opo. Pero dito po kasi is naturally po yung pagpapalaki sa kanila. 
yung ni-release naman sa wild successful naman siya. Um, yes ma'am, opo. Uh, Nakapag-release po kami last 2015 ng 15 heads ng Procodol Social na Madre. So ngayon po, ang um, update po nila na sa basta meet po nila. Kasi, kasi nag-conduct po sila doon ng, ng Procodol Sighting sa area. Medyo nasa 30 plus po yung na nandun. So marami dami pa rin naman po. Minumon dito pa rin. Yes ma'am. Apa. Proceed to the leg crop. Oh, to the Alright, um, everyone's aside from crocodiles, so here um, we have other white guys, but also we need to conserve. So that is the blue name parrot and Palawan talking mina. So everyone, these all birds are victims of poachers and illegal traders. And actually, they're already domesticated, so that's why we need to keep them. And for the Palawan talking mina, some of them have already learned how to speak. And sometimes they're saying bad words, which is not good. So that's why we need to. May nagturo nun. <laughs> Ay, wala po ako tinitignan. <laughs> Red joke lang po. Wala po. Ah, naturally po yun, naturally po. <laughs> Talino, ano? <laughs> Alright, so everyone, so let's go po. <laughs> Alright, so May everyone, eh. um, actually this is the viewing area and then now they're under renovation. Uh, so, here, Actually, some of them are captured from the wild and they need to capture because some of them is attack people and some of them are need to capture for the uh, breeding purposes and also for the fishing purposes. So, yeah, so that is the crocodile. Um, everyone, if you can see, um, are, crocodiles, that crocodile will open their mouth. Unlucky. So they need to open their mouth for two hours to release the heat or the cooling out. Yeah, so because crocodiles, they have no sweat, sweat glands. glands. Yes po, so hindi po sila pinagpapawisan. Tapos may, so, ibon, may ibon pang naglilinis mm, ng ano niya, di ba? Then minsan paro-paro. So, ah, ako po, po, dumadapos. niya lang, ano? Ako po, sir. <laughs> so that crocodile, we named Kalingaan. Um, we named Kalingaan because he was transferred here on June 12, 2018, a celebration of Philippine Independence Day. Um, he's one of the readers before, but now they're not productive na. Kaya po, nilipat dito. And also for the safety of the other favorite crocodiles because they have chance that they can kill the other crocodiles. Because of territory, crocodiles are very territorial or highly territorial. Yes, yeah, so yeah, that's why you need to transfer uh, adult crocodiles or make crocodiles. Okay, so let's go pa. Sa Dabao, pang commercial ang pakarami doon, ano? Opo, oh, sir. Dami. Patuloy po talaga nila pinaparami po for oh. commercial talaga. Kaya mayamay na po si Dabao. <laughs> <laughs> Malaki yung tax po nila. Alright, everyone. Uh, again, please take all of the things not to fall inside the fence, especially your phones. So, yeah. You can take pictures, you can take videos, but please, I'm so careful. Especially for this talk. Oh, laki, po. Sometimes, they, uh, they will be... Kala mo, statwa lang, ano? Ito malaki oh Nagpapalamig Alright everyone so you can take pictures now And then if you have questions po Tanong lang po kayo sa akin po ah So Ito. for this all big crocodile Sa Dabao mo mas marami Grabe dyan 5 to 10 kilos of meat for one week But we need to feed ah. them only twice a week Because they have slow metabolism and everyone, we feed them fresh meat like pork, beef, chicken, then any kinds of fish. Mm -hmm. And here, we're not allowed to give them or feed them live animals, like, like chicken, like beef, and also domestic animals like dogs and cats. So that is the fourth and fifth animal cruelty. Okay? And when she has a nature, what she has? Animals, fish, seafood. Seafood, yeah. But 
Ano to? Fresh water to. Ito din. Alright. Um, everyone, so this is the fresh water crocodiles, the pretty pink crocodiles, about five to seven years old. Oh, five to seven na to. Yeah, so this is all captive breed. Or dito po ito sa lapin na hanap. Ah, dito na. Oh, po. Dito na po yung sila pinis. Ilan ang itlog? Uh, Freshwater crocodile, sir, they can lay 30 to 40 eggs once a year, while saltwater crocodile, 40 to 80 eggs once a year, po. Oh, once a year? Yes, ma'am. And percentage of survival inside of the incubator. So, here, the captivity here, uh, we're using artificial incubator to make sure that 80 to 90 percent can survive. Um, on, in the wild, only 25 percent can survive. Para Because sa, to, parang turtle, yeah, na? Yes, sir. Sa wild, walang halos ano lang ilang percent lang. No. Five to seven years old now. Ito. So, ibig sabihin yung pang commercial na ano, ganyan lang kalalak? Hindi po, sir. Yun po yung pinapalaki na po nila ng gusto. Hindi yung ano, yung sa lead for leather? Yes, sir. Yun na nga po, pinapalaki po ng mga farmers. Gamit po yung mainit po na tubig. And how old is he? 60 to 70 years old, sir. 60 years? Yes. Oh, senior citizen. Senior, senior. Yeah. Senior citizen. Alright, so everyone here the viewing area. So this is the longest and uh, the oldest crocodile here in Rockland Park. And this crocodile uh, name Makmak. Mac. Si Mac -Mac. So Makmak -Mac because he was captured from Barangay Macarascas and that is northern port of Puerto Princesa. Approximately 70 to 80 years old and measured of 17 feet. He's almost same size of Rio the skeleton in the lobby. Ah, I see. Yes, an estimated weight of magma, 700 kilograms. Wow. So estimated lang po yun. Tulog po ata ma'am. Tulog, tulog, yan, tulog. Alright, and everyone, so crocodiles, ayan, so they can stay under the water for two hours without breathing. Crocodiles, they have no gales, like a fish, but again, they can stay under the water for two hours. So what they can do, um, they can change their heartbeat. Pag nakatulog sila ng mahaba, hindi na. Pwede, pwede. Ayun na, ilong lang ang nakalutang, ano? Ang galing, ayun na. Alright, and everyone yeah. said that crocodile po winning a clan, one of the biggest and one of the best breeder here in the crocodile farm. Wow. So that crocodile winning a clan because he was donated here by the municipality or the province of the clan in year 1989. Um, approximately 60 to 70 years old and measured of 16 feet. And then, everyone last crocodile in your right, left side. Or oh, right side, sorry, right side. So that is Marabahay from southern part of Palawan, approximately 30 to 40 years old and measured of 14 feet. And that crocodile was captured from the wild in last 2011. He also a victim of human and crocodile conflict like Rayon Lolong. He also attacked and killed human or a native fisherman from the area. So that's why he need to capture and bring here the captivity. Paano po nagbibreed kayo? Pinagsasama niyo yung babae lalaki? Yes sir. Tapos paghihiwala yan ulit? Pag medyo matanda na po sir yung lalaki, pwede. Oo po, hihiwalay na po sila. Pero normally, mag-isa lang sila sa isang kulungan. Oo po sir, especially for the saltwater crocodile. Because oh. saltwater crocodile, uh, again po, highly territorial po sila. So, they can so, paano nyo nalalaman crocodiles. kung time na ba i-breed or anytime? Ang age ng crocodiles are for breeding 8 to 12 years old pa. Hmm, pero ibig sabihin, may timing ba pagsama nila or mm, pagka na nag-lay na siya ng egg, pwede mo na isama uli ng ano, pwede o maghihintay na naman po. Pwede naman po na magkasama sila, na sila sa ah, face okay. po sa, ano, for, uh, for a long, long time po, oh. nang buhayin po nila na magkakasama na sila. Tapos, tatlo, paano siya nangyong itlog? Makikita na lang, may itlog na dyan. Hindi po sir, gumagawa po sila ng pugad, pugad. like pawikan din po. Uh -oh. So kailangan pala, kunyari ito, ililipat nyo pa ito. Hindi, hindi na. na sir. Saan Kasi, sila naglilay? Uh, ito po hindi na, hindi na po sila ah, mga non-productive na, na po sila eh. Eh. Oh, po. For, this, for educational purposes na lang po talaga sila oh. But uh, other crocodiles like freshwater crocodiles and the two uh, Yung mga nandun po sa dulo uh, uh, Pau B and Pinay uh, Pwede pa po silang ma-breed kasi mga breeders pa naman din po yung edad po nila Pwede pa Holding life or carrying a baby crocodile 
So you can proceed there, and that is only for 60 pesos. 60 okay? pesos. All right. So thank you so much, everyone. Good morning, point. Have a good day. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. So pwede tayong magpa-picture doon. Ah, tingnan natin yung ibang mga animals. Monday and Thursday or Friday. Depende pag may tiliver. Pag walang tiliver, magkakot ako. Ayun o. Ahas. Sawa. Ayun o. Wait, wait. Oh. Wow, adin yung mga nasa anong ahas, ano? Malunggay kinakain mo, brother? Wow, ano ka? Bakit ganun? Oh. Tortuga. Ayan, o. Pagong. Anak balat bad bebe oh. Change nang. Kau yang paling mahu kita nanti di tu. Gula ini panas lagi nang. Parang kaka balat ni lah. Tanggal nang ano? Grado di tu pagong din. Iyo nang. Benda. Pagongers. Taro lang tayo sa ano? Hawak ng ano? Crocodile. Grabe. Napugutan na ng ulo ito. Oh. Kinain yung ulo niya. Ayan. Ayan. Mayroon pa pala dito. Dito daw muna kami. Ayan o. Oh. Conservation. Oh. Uy, Imperial Pigeon. Ayun, laki. Grabe, kalapati. Ang laki. Galing. <laughs> Bebe, ang laki. Imperial Pigeon, wild to. Ganda pala. Oh. You know? Hmm. Saging kinakain niya. Pag yan pinakawalan mo, hindi na makakabat. Hindi na babalik. Eh, hindi ko alam. Ang laki oh. Kalapatids. Ayan oh. Fruit eating birds. Ayan. Ayan ba ba yung badala na tulad? <laughs> pangkarera yan, pangkarera Ay, pangkarera yan, kuya <laughs> Hindi ko alam Wild Ay, pangkarera <laughs> Kasi bato-bato, ano din Alam ko, parang ano din siya Yung, yung emerald dab, di ba? Wow Ito yung ano Oo oh, nga Oh, hanggang dito na lang tayo oh, old ano na to hindi na ah, ito. Ah, ano na to matagal na nasaan yung ano ah, yung porcupine oo nga meron dati dito porcupine ay may porcupine nakakita kami dun po sa oo oh, sabi niya di ba meron nasa kaya yun Porcupine ba? Uy, ang taba! Gamay may libag na lang. Ang musang. Ayun. Uy, ang cute niya! Mahirap ko mo naman ang metabolism ng buhay at eh. Para tumaba ka. Ay, karami ka! Slow metabolism yun eh, katulad namin. Oo nga, no? Uy, hindi siya umaalis. Sa katali ba? Hindi. Hindi ba? The wild cat? Hindi. Hindi siya nakakulong, ano? Bear cat. Kasi po, kaya hindi siya tinawag na wild cat. Kasi hindi siya magalaw. Kaya, ano, quiet. 
<laughs> subscriber pala natin to. Ayan, thank you, thank you. Sa totoo Ayan. lang sir talaga sir, karamihan ng mga ano ko sa inyo ko po talaga nakuha. Ah, licho. Sa so, pagiging si Ben. Ang galing. Kinala ko si sir eh. <laughs> Ano, po? ano pong pangalan ng litsyo ninyo po dito? Bali nag-stop po kasi ngayon po, nagmahal po yung babi po. Oo, oh, doon grabe sa pampanga, mahal eh. <laughs> Picture ako kayo sarap pagkita ko sa gulitin ko. Di ba ba yung step ako naman ako si itong kapal? Yan, yan. Kamera niyo po. So ayan mga ka-farmer City tour ng ating Palawan na Ano ba to? Adventure Ayan Crocodile Park Ano ba ito? Ayan, Palawan Wildlife Rescue and Conservation Center Pero ang ano nila is dito is more on crocodile So ayan ang galing Magkaiba po sila ng sa Davao Sa Davao is more on commercial pala Dito naman is Pinapalaki nila and then nire-release nila Yan naman po ang kaibahan So ayan, kaya pala mas maraming Crocodile doon sa Palawan kasi ay sa Palawan sa Dabao kasi daw nandoon ang mass production talaga yung talagang inaano nila ah uh, mina market po nila no so dito naman ang focus po nila is yung uh, yung uh, fresh water yata yung pinararami nila and then release nila sa wild so ayan maraming maraming salamat at magandang buhay